Hey everybody, it's Jaya and Ian and you've been watching our 52 week sex life makeover challenge here on YouTube and we've been in a little 10 week challenge as part of that, a 10 week sex life challenge and you just completed it if you've watched all of the 10 videos. If not, stop this right now and go to video for the week one of the sex life challenge where we talk about what this is all about. Otherwise, this is gonna make no Oops. sense to you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> for those of you who have completed it, yay! Yay, give yourself a happy dance. You just did your you first did sex life challenge. It. You did it. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> and I think one of the most important things as you're wrapping up on these challenges is to actually reward yourself. So how are you gonna reward yourself for completing all 10 weeks of your sex life challenge? Is it gonna be if you're in a couple, a nice romantic dinner out? Is it going to be if you're a single, maybe you go and get yourself a massage or you sign up for that new dating class you wanted to take or whatever it is that you wanted to do? Like what's a way that you can pamper and reward yourself? Because this is no small feat to, mm -hmm. to actually complete 10 weeks of all the things we've been giving you. So that's one thing. Now your other reward is what did you learn? What are your big takeaways? We want you to comment below, like what are the big things that you got out of doing this challenge? What are some of your takeaways? What are the things that were your insights that you gained? What were discoveries you made? You can talk about physical practices that you actually picked up and learned. You can talk about the things that you learned about your partner that, that now you know, you understand how mm -hmm. they're being turned on. Or your own body. Yeah, and you can talk about emotional stuff that's come up. Like, where were you before you started this challenge? And where are you now in terms of your mm -hmm. connection, your knowledge and skill level? It's just, you. Give us everything you got. All right, so there's <laughs> what you've learned, what your rewards are, what your insights, your takeaways are. And then there's also discussing what really worked. Mm. So let us know also what really worked for you. What did you love about doing this challenge? Was it having time set aside? Was it you know spending time together with your partner? Was it learning about your own body? Mm. What really worked? What was really effective? What was really powerful for you? that you want to do more of. Mm -hmm. So let us know in the comments as well, but I want you to, if you're with a partner or you're journaling in your own note notebook, if you're single, then I want you to write down, what do I want more of? What really worked for me? What is it that I re really want more of? And then the next piece is what would you do differently next time mm. to make it even better? Mm -hmm. So maybe next time it's like, I really want to get that massage table next time or hey you know next time I really want to make sure that we have all the dates in our schedule because we didn't do that at mm -hmm. first and we saw it started falling off or hey next time I really want to make sure that we set up a challenge that's even easier right or the, or the rules of our challenge are really clear because I didn't know if I was winning or failing mm -hmm. and this isn't about being critical or what went wrong or you did this or that it's just what would we do differently next time I want to make sure you stay out of criticism judgment and more into what can we do differently that would make this even hotter yeah because it's all information so if something didn't go right then it's just information of what how you can course correct and mm -hmm. do it even better and in you know give that pleasure and that connection to your relationship even deeper so let us know, what were your highlights? What were your big takeaways, big learnings? What are things you love that you wanna do more of? Mm. And what are things you could do differently next time to make it even more amazing, even hotter, juicier, passionate, yep. able to win, all that kind of good stuff. And all don't, right. don't waste any time, plan your next one now. Yeah, go ahead, plan your next one now. We got more amazing stuff coming up in this 52 week challenge. And I just wanna congratulate and encourage you one more time. You rock, you're amazing. High five. High five. <laughs> and uh, until next week, fill your, your life with, with pleasure. pleasure.